So today we're going to work on planting our peony field. We got a lot of requests from you guys to uh, plant peonies. Some peonies even live up to 100 years. So we've got plenty of time to enjoy these beautiful flowers. Peonies take about three years to become established, so they won't be ready to pick next year. We'll pinch off the buds for the next year or two so that the plant can concentrate all its energy on building new roots instead of the blooms. And this will help the plant grow thicker and healthier faster. So we're hoping by year three we'll have some peonies to, uh, available for you all to cut. I'm cutting but, holes for the peonies. So I am measuring every five feet apart and I am cutting an X so we can plant our peony tubers. So the peonies come in a bag like this. I'll just open it up and I'll show you what the peony tubers look like. I think there's maybe three in here. Mm. trying to get in a good spot where the the wind isn't blowing the dirt right in my eyes okay so the eyes of the peony are these little pink guys here and you're gonna we're gonna plant these so that the little pink eyes are pointing up and all of these tuber parts of the root system are going to be pointing down and we're going to make sure that this is not underground more than an inch or two um, it wants to stay fairly close to the surface. So this is just one. <laughs> it's a big guy. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's what we're going to plant today. And they're already starting to get like little roots on them. Isn't that cute? <laughs> so we've had all the soil tilled up a couple or three or four times previously. So the dirt should be pretty soft inside we'll open our bag these are bowl of cream that sounds really nice now this one's not as big as that other one okay, there's the eyes and we're gonna plant them with the eyes growing up And we'll, so the eyes are pointing up and we're making sure that the top of the peony is just so there you can just see it and we'll just cover it with uh, about an inch, an inch and a half of dirt on top. Any deeper and it may not bloom. Really warm climates only need to bury them about an inch. Colder climates about two inches and we never really know what we're going to get in Kentucky so we're going to do one to two inches. Good. It's supposed to rain. 90% chance of rain all day tomorrow. So these will get a good watering in tomorrow. That'll be nice.
So we are finished peony planting. So, yay. The only thing that we haven't planted that we wanted to plant for the fall was some of our irises. And I think the shipment is probably not gonna come. We planted some irises that were given to us, but the ones that we ordered, I don't think they're gonna make it. I'm gonna call tomorrow. So, peonies, and that was it. So, we are probably finished with our fall planting. We've already ordered our glads. Um, we've ordered 30,000 gladiolas that will come in the spring, and we'll plant those in the spring. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We've got 13 varieties, and um, I'll just put the uh, picture up here. Angel Cheeks, Cherry Hill, Duchess de Namur, Bowl of Beauty, Red Charm, Bowl of Cream, Shirley Temple, Raspberry Sunday, Bowl of Cream, Coral Charm, Coral Sunset, Coral Supreme, and Etched Salmon. And those are the varieties we have. A lot of them are foods. I was just, I was reading this. Okay, so <laughs> there are a lot of pinks, hot pinks, light pinks, um, and then the Red Charm. I can't wait to see that. I don't know that I've ever seen a red peony in person, so. That'll be exciting. These probably won't bloom next year. Um, if they do come up and have some buds, we'll pinch off the buds so uh, they can put all of their energy into the root system and building that for years to come. Um, peonies can live up to 100 years, so that's kind of amazing. Um, and who knows, maybe we'll plant more peonies next year. Uh, and as always, let us know if there's a certain peony that you want, you know, you, your grandmother had this variety of peony and you haven't seen it, you know, for so long, you'd love to see it and come pick it. Um, definitely send us a message or pop it in the comments below. We love the different varieties that you don't no normally see, so we'll try to find it for you. Thanks for joining us today. We appreciate it. And if you enjoyed the video, please like it and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos. And we will keep them coming. See you next time. Next week it's going to be super cold, freezy, frosty. I don't know if we're going to get any snow or not. We hope for a little bit of cold for the tulips. We hope for less cold for the lavender. So I don't know, maybe the peonies are somewhere in between. Thanks for watching, guys. Did you know that the little ants that always um, are crawling around the peony buds, they don't actually hurt the peonies. They actually um, somehow have a symbiotic relationship. They, they kind of need each other. I think the sap that the buds gives off is obviously the ants eat that. And I think that kind of helps the peony uh, bud to open. So that's what I've heard. Um, maybe we can look that up.